what if i told you there is a secret code hidden in the very fabric of numbers stay tuned as we decode the enigma of prime numbers revealing a world of secrets you never knew existed let's get started so what are prime numbers except the number 1 each natural number which is divisible by 1 and itself is called a prime number let me repeat except the number 1 each natural number which is divisible by 1 and itself is called a prime number look at the number 2 number 2 is divisible by 1 and itself and hence 2 is a prime number let's look at the number 3 number 3 is divisible by 1 and itself and hence 3 is a prime number number 5 is divisible by 1 and itself and hence 5 is a prime number numbers like 2 3 5 7 11 13 which are divisible by 1 and itself are prime numbers there are infinite prime numbers and number 2 is the only even prime number the property of being prime is called primality this slide it has the list of all prime numbers less than 100 there are 25 prime numbers less than 100 number 97 is the only prime number between 90 and 100 let's move on to the types of prime numbers not all prime are created equal did you know about mega primes semi primes fermat primes or mersenne primes each type of prime number unveils a new layer of complexity contributing to the mathematical wonders a titanic prime is a prime number with at least 1000 digits a gigantic prime is a prime number with at least 10000 digits a mega prime is a prime number with at least 1 million digits there are dozens of different classes of prime numbers like Pythagorean prime, Mersenne prime, Lucas prime, Gaussian prime, Happy prime, Lucky prime, etc. Let's look at some fun facts about prime numbers. Did you know that the largest known prime number has over 24 million digits? 2 is the smallest prime number and 2 is the only prime number which is an even number number 2 and 3 are two consecutive primes except for numbers 0 and 1 a whole number is either a prime number or a composite number no prime number greater than 5 ends in a 5 here is a fun challenge for you find the prime number which is the sum of four consecutive prime numbers find the answer and write it in the comment section let's move on to composite numbers. numbers while prime numbers bask in the spotlight let's not forget their counterparts the composite numbers all natural numbers which are not prime are composite numbers except the number 1 the number 1 is neither prime nor composite numbers like 4 6 8 9 10 and 12 these are composite numbers because they are not prime numbers every composite number can be written as the product of two or more prime numbers let's move on to coprime numbers numbers much like relationships can achieve harmony coprime numbers are relatively prime share a unique kinship their greatest common divisor is one a pair of two natural numbers having no common factor other than one is called a pair of coprimes look at numbers 3 and 5 they have no common factor other than 1 and hence 3 and 5 are coprimes look at numbers 7 and 9 they have no common factor other than 1 and hence 7 and 9 are coprimes now let's venture into the realm of twin primes mathematical siblings in the vast landscape of numbers prime numbers differing by 2 are called twin primes look at numbers 3 and 5 they are both prime numbers and have a difference of 2 and hence 3 and 5 are coprimes Look at numbers 11 and 13. They are both prime numbers and have a difference of 2 and hence 11 and 13 are coprimes. Mersenne primes are a unique breed among primes, taking their name from the French mathematician Marin Mersenne. Mersenne primes are primes that can be expressed as 2 to the power p minus 1, where p is also a prime number. Exponents p which give Mersenne primes are 2, 3, 5, 7, etc. and the resulting Mersenne primes are 3 7 31 127 etc let's look at some examples of mersenne primes 2 to the power 2 minus 1 equals 4 minus 1 which is equal to 3 and 3 is a prime number so this fits into the mersenne prime category 2 to the power 
3 minus 1 equals 8 minus 1 which is 7 and 7 is a prime number. 2 to the power 5 minus 1 equals 32 minus 1 which is equal to 31 and 31 is a prime number. 2 to the power 7 minus 1 equals 128 minus 1 which is equal to 127 and 127 is a prime number. As of 2024, 51 Mersenne primes are known to us. In fact, the largest known prime number is a Mersenne prime discovered in 2018 and boasting a staggering 23 million digits. Let's move on to the fundamental theorem of arithmetic. Imagine numbers as a grand architectural design and the fundamental theorem of arithmetic as its master blueprint. It's like discovering the DNA of numbers, revealing their fundamental building blocks that shape our mathematical universe. Here is the fundamental theorem of arithmetic. Every integer greater than 1 can be expressed as a unique product of prime numbers. The number 10 can be expressed as a product of 2 and 5. And here numbers 2 and 5 are prime numbers. The number 12 can be expressed as 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 where 2 and 3 are prime numbers. The number 14 can be expressed as 2 multiplied by 7 where numbers 2 and 7 are prime numbers. Any integer greater than 1 is either a prime number or can be written as a unique product of prime numbers. This is the fundamental theorem of arithmetic. There is a unique conjecture in mathematics. It's called as Goldbach's conjecture. Goldbach's conjecture is a mathematical hypothesis proposed by German mathematician Christian Goldbach. He wrote a letter to Euler in 1742. The conjecture suggests that every even integer greater than 2 can be expressed as the sum of two prime numbers. Imagine taking any even number over 2 and Goldbach believes it can be crafted by adding two prime numbers. For example, 10 is the sum of 3 and 7, both primes. This works for a host of even numbers, creating a captivating pattern. Now here is the catch. While the conjecture has been checked for vast numbers and it holds true. It remains unproven for all even numbers. Mathematicians continue to explore this tantalizing puzzle, working towards a conclusive proof. There you have it, a glimpse into the captivating world of prime numbers. From their types and fun facts to the role in the fundamental theorem, primes are the unsung heroes of mathematics. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. If you have found it helpful, smash that like button. It really helps helps us out. We would love to hear your thoughts and ideas, so drop a comment down below. Whether it is a suggestion, a question or just saying hello, we appreciate every comment. Join me next time as we continue our journey through the wonders of the mathematical universe. Until then, keep exploring and stay curious.